I'm guessing that we're C54. If I'm right, I win a prize. <laughs> Good morning everyone. Today we are going to be taking you guys along for our day in the life of expanding our business. We are so excited and I am wearing my flamingos because a year ago today we were in Aruba getting ready to get married. This weekend is our anniversary, first year anniversary, which is super exciting. Here with Grace. Hi Grace. We didn't have you a year ago. It's not even your birthday yet. So, what we are doing today is going to Ikea to pick up a table because right now, I was gonna head inside and show you guys. This is currently our setup. So we have the cutting section and the sewing section all on one table. And when you look at it like this, it's not that big of a deal, but when you have fabric laying here and also have bandanas laying there, it's very crowded space when we're working at the same time. So to make our life a little bit easier, we are going to put another table. We'll probably reorganize this whole section, build a table and everything. And I had been saying I wanted to do this for a while and I put it off because I was trying to search for the perfect sewing table. And then I just kind of gave up on that and I'm like, let's just get an Ikea. Basically it's a desk and we're gonna see how that works. It's the cheapest method and hopefully the easiest method for now. And we have so many fun and exciting things coming to Tails Up Pup so soon. Um, I am very excited and I hope you guys will be excited for the new products that are coming. We have like a whole new product section and then a whole new type of bandana hopefully coming soon. Let me show y'all our new collars. These are so beautiful. We have this one that's basically like a Lily Pulitzer kind of pattern, which has been super popular with some gold. And then we also have this one, which we have in a bandana, and it's a beautiful floral. They both have been super popular, so if you would like to grab one of these collars for your dogs, be sure to do it, because I'm not sure we can get, especially this one, I'm not sure we can get this one back. So, get them while you can. I'm trying to find out how I can set you guys up to show you my thought of what we're gonna do once we get the table in here. Basically, I think that we need to take this table and turn it the other way so that there's more room here and then put the new desk up against this wall so the sewing machine like when you're using it you'd be facing the wall which is gonna be pretty boring but maybe we can figure out how to hang some pictures or something up there but I'm not quite sure once we get the desk in here we'll see how much space we even have and knowing Ikea stuff it's going to be very difficult to build so hopefully we don't have any issues also we'll give you guys a sneak peek hopefully these will be up by the time that this video is up a set of two best friend bandanas so cute i've been wanting to do this i've had this idea for a while finally got around to doing it and drinking buddy hi holly how are you say i'm one years old now we also wanted to thank y'all for a, a thousand, thousand subscribers. subscribers we are so excited that was our goal for a, a long while. time <laughs> but we finally reached it and it's super exciting for us and you can only go up from here i think reaching a thousand is super super hard and hopefully we'll just continue to grow but we're so excited for this youtube channel and we'll always remember our zion trip as what helped us reach the mark of a thousand subscribers i'm guessing that we're c54 if i'm right i win a prize is it hard to turn so I see some damages to the box and I'm wondering if we need to inspect it before we leave the facility. <laughs> yeah. How heavy do you think it's gonna be? Heavy. You do? Really? I mean kinda like crazy but like heavy. Do you want me to inspect, open it? That was probably the easiest pickup we've ever done. We did the click and collect, so like it was already purchased and everything. We literally walked in, it was already on a cart, and walked out. But good thing Nicholas came because I was like, you don't need to come, you don't need to come. I could do it by myself, and I couldn't have done it by myself. It was well, you heavy. could have, it just was... Yeah. 
it would have really sucked. It would have sucked. And I would have probably had to ask someone to help me. And that's always scary for me. <laughs> but now the hard part to put it together. <sighs> Hopefully it's not that hard. But it will be. So, what do you think? Complicated? Always. At least they have decent directions, it looks like. Tell me what you have to go and drive me so crazy. Now I'm feeling lost without you and I just can't be. With that tough, baby, won't you all night long, won't you all night long. Tell me what you have to go and drive me so crazy. Now I'm feeling lost without you and I just can't be. We had no fights, we had no disagreements, everything was in the directions. So, IKEA furniture is easier to build than Costco furniture, wouldn't you say? Probably so. <laughs> I think it looks really nice and has some drawers, which is nice. And I think it's gonna be a great workspace for me. And they're gonna love having the cutting table. It's the perfect size. This is what the space from. The worst part is this. Yeah, but we've always had the head issues. Good thing we're not too tall. My butt is. <laughs> so walk them through the workflow now. Okay, so go walk in, and if you're going to be cutting, go grab your fabric over here and bring it over here to cut. And then you'll walk over to iron, and we're going to get some kind of like shelf thing here because I used to lay all the bandanas on the bench, but there's not really room for a bench here. So for now, the chair will do. So like the bandanas that need to be sewn will be here, and then I'll be in my nice chair here, sewing away. That's basically it. <laughs> I think it'll be nice. It will be very nice. It's like more of a flow rather than all the congestion. The worst part was that like when we had these lights put in, now there's no light over there. I don't think it's gonna be an issue, and if it were, he could always come back and just put another light there. I mean, it's pretty dark over here, but the sewing machine has a light. But it would be nice to have an overhead light, but we'll see once we start. We could get another lamp. I don't like lamps. I hope it makes you as excited as it does to us about seeing all the growth that we have here at Tails Up Pup and always transforming our space into something even better. It's so much fun to learn and grow, and we hope to see you guys soon. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and go check out TailsUpPup.com. Bye! I would do anything just to get you back again. I would do anything at all. No, I'm not innocent. You deserve a better man. Let me just hold your hand once more Ooh, 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 ooh I wanna take you out